uh, semantic backup exec uh, tutorials in this tutorial uh, I will be showing you how to uh, make your storage offline and make it online or disable your storage uh, it can be your tape library or it can be your uh, disk storage or it can be your backup disk folder okay uh, let's launch the backup exec user interface by clicking the icon on the desktop and the current version we are using is semantic backup exec 2015 trial version on windows 2008 r2 so once you launch uh, your gui the user interface uh, shows various tabs on the top home backup and restore job monitor storage go ahead and click on storage so it will list all your um, uh, storage like your disk storage or a backup disk folder or your tape library or your uh, san uh, connected drive okay so just go ahead and select your storage okay and uh, right click on it you can see there is an option pause disable if you highlight if you select pause it will just pause the device to prevent scheduled and new jobs okay from running on it and if you disable it will completely disable device to prevent the schedule and new jobs from running on it okay what happens if i click on post what exactly it will happen so currently the state is online now it says post and you can see the icon here also changed on the storage okay and right click and unselect it the pause button it will immediately go to online state all right and the next thing is if I select disable, see the state disable and the icon here, it shows a little bit red. So there is a difference between, so you can identify on the uh, the icon itself on the storage, whether it is disabled or whether it is paused. Okay. And right click and uncheck disable, it will come online immediately. So this is how you will uh, pause or disable depending upon your requirements. And the other thing is, details it will show your uh, I mean if you want to rename your storage you can do it and you can also uh, limit the file size okay and also uh, the threshold value how much percent it should throw a, an alert saying that hey your storage is very low and also the concurrent uh, sessions that can happen uh, on that particular storage and this is the path So this is how this is this is all the uh, your storage uh, details currently uh, since this is a test environment I got only disk storage all right so um, thank you guys for uh, watching and stay tuned for more updates on uh, semantic backup exec tutorials bye for now.